that a flag was still there. Under bright blue skies and the watchful eyes of gold star mothers who've lost children in our nation's wars, a renewed commitment to America's veterans, among them David Lente. It means, it means the world. Lente served 24 years in the Navy before joining the Army at Fort Lewis. He suffered PTSD in his second deployment in the first Iraq war and knows countless others suffer every single day. It's still there. It always will be with, you know, specific vets and stuff, but um, you have those resources and you have those skills that were taught to you to, to try to overcome those and keep moving forward. The new memorial replaces the Vietnam era monument decommissioned last July to make room for renovations at the Snohomish County Courthouse honoring our veterans one lesson learned from Vietnam. So I think it's really important because I know a lot of times now, um, you know, Vietnam vets over the period of time, you know, definitely got forgotten. Um, I think the programs that are instilled now within America in general are starting to come back. Honor Guard, bring her to life. With the Naval Station Everett Honor Guard raising five new flags, the new memorial is much more prominent than the last, a place of honor that veterans like David Lente believe proves Americans still care a nation nearly two decades into our longest war. You know, being able to know that that respect is there for, for the vets and the currently, you know, men and women serving and also those that have. In Everett, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.